Helen Neal had uh, been a 1962 graduate of West Texas, but what was so interesting about that was she was the first African-American student to graduate with a bachelor's degree. I went to WT, what it was, 1960, I believe, that the NAACP filed a suit. The NAACP had to file twice before they got WT open. And uh, they needed somebody at that particular time to be that test person. I had finished high school in 1943 <coughs> at a integrated school. So I was kind of familiar with being the one. So that, I was used to that, you know. It didn't really bother me. Since I had four children, husband and a dog, I didn't think I had time to do that. So Johnny Dale Gilstrot became the test case. And I did not think of myself as being a, the first, because Johnny Dale should have been that first person. But Johnny Dale developed a knot on her hand, and she could not give her piano recital that was required of the senior. So then I came, became the first uh, as a result of that. So I don't think of myself as being that person. I think of Johnny Dale as being that person who paved the way. They were the ones that paved the way for me because I enjoyed, you know, the um, being able to go to West Texas. Had a great time um, after we had got over the hurdles of being there in the 60s. Watch the complete video library of our voices by visiting kacv.org.